Hey friends, Mike and Jess here. And welcome to Regeneration Nation TV. And we are continuing with something a little new. This is another one from the request from our last video, which is a Filipino drinking etiquette 101. This is Filipino teen speaks 18 languages. I'm yes. very excited. Thank you for all the positive reception on that video. We were a little nervous about we doing a different type of content, but you guys seem to really enjoy it. My mom called me up. She's like, that was freaking hilarious. <laughs> Please do more stuff like that. We want to do more stuff like that. It was so enjoyable and we love touching and getting into different cultures from all around the world, seeing what other people are doing, seeing what other people like and just trying new things. Yeah. I've lived in Florida my whole life, okay? I have never seen snow. I'm very not cultured, okay? <laughs> so I need your help yes. to be more cultured yes. and diversified mm -hmm. and much appreciated, okay? Yes. And now, I don't know if we can afford to get out of the country anytime soon. So this is also another little outlet for us. Somebody did say like, just come to the Philippines already. What we the heck love, are you waiting for? Oh, we would love to do that. But like, well, <laughs> in the meantime, we're gonna have to do to make do with this. So. Getting out of debt first is the first priority, <laughs> but you know, definitely. college debt is ridiculous over here, man. <laughs> okay, I know you've heard nightmares, horror stories about it, okay? <laughs> Maybe one of you should react to the nightmarish uh, tale of college debt in america nobody wants know. to see that it's a nobody wants story. to see it it's nope. literally a horror movie anyways this is going to be fun filipino teen speaks 18 languages what i don't know what to expect me either let's, let's get into it <laughs> i'm marlon and i'm 18 and i'm today i'm going to speak in 18 languages he has a language for every year that he was born that is impressive. That's insane. Ilalam mo na ako sa inyo lahat. Ako po si Marlon Ramos, labing walong taong kulang na, at purong Pilipina po ako. At ipinanganak ako dito sa Pilipinas. Tayo dito ako ipinanganak sa Pilipinas sa tural lamang na nagsasalita na ako ng Tagalog. Ang wikang Tagalog ay ang ginagamit sa pang-araw-araw kong buhay. At ang pag-aaral ng iba't ibang lingwahe ay aking naging paboritong gawain. At kung paano ko sila natutunan lahat ay aking tatalakay ngayon. You silly pants. What? I didn't have to put the clothes lahat ay aking tatalakay ngayon. Ang naging paboritong gawain. At kung paano ko sila natutunan lahat ay aking tatalakay ngayon. I have the subtitles on from here on out though. Okay, okay good. That's insane though. He speaks so well as well. Oh, like, I just wonder what language your thoughts are in at this point, you know? You could just go and just flow it all together <laughs> what I language would. do you think in yeah. <laughs> at the age of six i was taught the english language it is the second language of the philippines and so we were taught english the english language here in the philippines in like in the first grade and up to college i think so that is why i think english is a language that i'm most comfortable speaking with because you know I've studied uh, a lot of years. I'm fluent in it and I could speak with any English speaker in the world. Well, I that's, think. That's really Learning cool. languages wasn't in my mind and it's like it's the last thing I could do, but at the age of 12, I knew I was contented with only two languages. That's pretty crazy. Spanish as what? well. Man, I wonder what led him down this road to learn all of these languages. For real, at 12, he was not content with only speaking two languages. And that's beautiful. He decided yeah. on his own that he's going to, I need to speak more languages. These subtitles are auto-generated, it looks like. So they're not going to be like perfect, okay? Not going to be perfect, but we'll be able to get the gist, yeah, hopefully. Yeah, of what he's saying. Empecé a aprender idiomas extranjeros cuando tenía 12 años y el español fui el primero. Pienso que la razón por que decidí de aprenderlo era cuando miré una película de la biografía de nuestro héroe nacional, José Rizal. Yeah, let's just turn these off. This yeah. is ruining it for it, me. It is ruining <laughs> it. I'm like, just... it's Rihanna. What? I just want to. <laughs> Jeez. Gosh, what is YouTube doing? Era cuando miré una película de la biografía de nuestro héroe nacional, José Rizal. La película estaba en filipino y español, y en ese momento me dije que me gusta el sonido de la lengua española, pues voy a aprender ese idioma. Al comienzo tení dificultad en la gramática porque, a diferencia de Tagalog, el español tiene muchos verbos tiempos que no entendía, pero seguía con determinación de aprender ese idioma. No tenía un libro ni una maestra, para enseñarme, si no tenía solo un cuaderno y el internet. Pero el vocabulario... Did he just say he learned over the internet? 
I I heard the internet. I don't know what he said, but that's insane if he said that. Pero es muy fácil para mí porque los los españoles, los castellanos colonizaron nuestro país por tres siglos. Ahora la lengua filipina tiene muchas palabras similares con el español. Filipino language is similar to Espanol a little bit. That's what I heard. That's what you heard at the end? That's what I heard. You don't know Spanish. I heard what I heard, okay? Goodness Let me know me. if I heard right, okay? The Filipino language is similar to the, the, the Spanish language. Could possibly. <laughs> I mean, honestly, a lot of these languages could be similar because it's like once you, I feel like once you learn one, it's kind of like, they're not all like similar. They're not like all similar words, but I mean, especially Italian, French, and Spanish, they were talking. They were taught to us in school, like there's similarities in their words. Yeah. But I don't know. I don't. I don't and know. I, them I mean, still back in a, a few hundred years ago, these different countries that were well established went and conquered and settled like all over the world and like forced their belief systems and their languages on other cultures. So it wouldn't be surprised, like surprising for me to learn that there's a lot of mixture between the languages like right. that. Quando ho finito lo spagnolo, mi ho detto che voglio più imparare più lingue. Allora ho cercato attraverso dell'internet che sono le più facili di imparare. E la... Allora ho imparato l'italiano. La grammatica italiana è molto similare con lo spagnolo perché sono in stessa famiglia di lingue. Sempre parlo con i miei amici per aiutarmi a praticarlo. Ci sono volte quando i miei amici mi dicono che io vado pazzo perché parlo in molte lingue. What in the world? It sounded again like it was there's some similarities. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Between the languages. I heard some words. Like I kind of yeah, want to play a game with uh, myself to see if I can tell if there's any words. I don't know any of these uh, languages need to fluently. Learn languages, guys. We need to. This is so inspiring. <laughs> this is so inspiring. That is amazing, man. Anche ho avuto un amico italiano da Napoli che ho incontrato per Facebook. Mi aiuta sempre con il mio italiano, sempre correggi gli errori grammaticali che ho fatto. That is insane. He said he learned it on Facebook, I'm pretty sure. I heard I'm Facebook. I heard kidding. Facebook. If any, I'm not <laughs> trying to be offensive, I promise. I'm just joking. Yeah. I'm in a bit of a jovial mood this evening as well, so <laughs> I'm not trying to offend. If I offend anybody, I apologize. Just joking. But I swear he did say I learned it on Facebook. Because <laughs> you know Italian. <laughs> Alors, j'ai appris une autre langue, et c'est français. La raison que je l'ai appris est parce que j'aime la France. Je veux aller à Paris avec ma petite amie. Euh, le ramer français, c'est facile parce qu'il est très similaire avec l'italien et l'espagnol. Mais le plus difficile pour moi est le français chant. Je serai présent, il est très terrible. Alors, je, je pratique toujours ma bouche pour que ma français chant s'améliore. That's crazy. And he's doing all this with like sitting in a bathtub with a shower curtain behind him. You don't know that. And I heard um, a rooster. I did. I wonder if he lives near Roland. Okay, we just got done listening to Roland. Yeah. You are the reason. And his chickens were trying to sing with him. It was yeah, beautiful. Yeah, it was awesome. Beautiful. <laughs> Agora eu vou falar português. Uma vez quando eu estava assistindo vídeos no YouTube, eu encontrei um music video e a canção estava em português e fiquei surpreso que eu posso entender as letras. O português é muito fácil de aprender e realmente é uma língua do espanhol. E agora eu, eu posso falar com brasileiro e portugueses em mensagens somente, mas eu não posso falar pessoalmente porque não há muitos portugueses aqui nas Filipinas. That's crazy, man. I watched UFC for a very long time. They have a lot of international fighters and I will watch like pre-fight, post-fight press conferences. And a lot of them, you know, they, they just speak their native language and you have to get the interpreter to interpret it. So I've, I've heard people speak all of these languages uh -huh. and his, his dialect seems to be so perfect. Like yeah. his pronunciation of the words, like it seems so well, it seems so good. Uh, it's still I yeah as soon as he's speaking it it's like you close your eyes and you're like somebody who is from that that speaking that language comfortably all the time is yeah. speaking to you like what 
German. Oh, this reminds me of my brother. Jets, yeah, Jess's brother actually speaks German. Yeah, I wish he, he was here right now. He could tell us how well he, he, he speaks it. Yeah, he could tell us that and tell us what he's saying. I, I'm freaked <laughs> out. If you have a deep voice and you uh, speak German, I'm freaked out. Okay, it's like watching a horror movie. It does. Okay? They, it does come off very aggressive. It's a spooky language. Yeah. Especially the deeper your voice, it is spooky, dude. <laughs> ich Deutsch sprechen. Mein Kopf, ich studierte, als ich Deutsch studierte. Es ist sehr schwer, um zu lernen. Aber ich sagte meinem Geist, dass ich Deutsch lernen kann, wenn ich will. So ich die deutsche Grammatik lernte. Und dann lernte ich, dass keine Sprache ist schwer, wenn man resolut und begeistert, um eine Fremdsprache gut zu lernen ist. Jetzt kann ich Deutsch sprechen. Ich habe immer gesprochen mit den deutschen Sprachen. He didn't make it sound. What? He didn't make it sound haunting, like you. No, say. no, no, no. The he lighter your it. voice, the more I'm okay with it. Okay. <laughs> your brother has a bit of a deep voice. And yeah, he, he does. And but man, some German <laughs> guys, they have such deep voices. I know you guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> if you hear a very deep voiced guy talking German, I'm out of there. You will not. You'll look around and look for me. I'm gone. Okay. Hiding under a blanket, shaking. <laughs> <laughs> make it stop. <laughs> Dude, what? Ik heb geleerd, werd Daily in print me in het Nederlands te proberen, omdat het gemakkelijk is en vergelijkbaar met het uit in Engels. Dus ik probeerde het en ik vond het zo leuk. Ik gebruik Duolingo om het te leren en ik, skeel, en ik speel in keer per week. En nu kan ik spreken met Nederlands, ik voelt me maar uh, niet erg vloeiend. Dat was de weirdest one so far. The way that they enunciate some yeah. words, like what in the heck? That is crazy. This is so impressive. What did that say? Africans. I did not know that was a language. That's crazy. I yeah, I haven't heard of that. Now Afrikaans. This is my lifting taal that I geleerd had. I had gedink that dit een moeilijke taal te leren was, maar toen ik dit leren begin het, dit is zo makkelijk. Die grammatica is makkelijk te verstaan. Die woorden is van Engels en van Duits en van Nederlands. Ik denk dat dit, een mooi, dat dit de makkelijkste taal in de wereld is. Ik luister, ik luister altijd naar Afrikaanse muziek, zoals die David Wasserfalls en Brendan Papers muziek. Dat is crazy. Esperanto. I haven't heard of that. These are We're getting into languages that I didn't even know existed mm -mm. now. This nope. is insane. Zijn kouling van Esperanto. Oni diras ki GS is le play fat sile lingvo en la mondo. Kaj mi opinas tro. Se venes cies Esperanto. GS is inventita lingvo de Dr. Zamenhof. Li faris tion lingvo por universala lingvo por ke homo i povas lerni gin. Fat sile kaj par le gin. Kvan kom gin i es es natura lingvo. Multaj homo i ankora u lernes gin. Do se vi volas lerni tre fat sile lingvo. This is crazy because he's not just saying like words, just like random he's words. Like the, to yeah, you. he's speaking yeah, to he's you. Literally having like the conversation. He's talking about that specific language, maybe, but he's literally having sentences. It sounds like he's explaining why or how he learned the yeah, language. Yeah, and, and what the differences are. Language. That's what the, it seems yeah. like he's singing like, or saying. What? This singing. is so crazy and so mind blowing and so inspirational. Mm -hmm. So cool. What? Now we're on to Indonesian. I saya belajar bahasa Indonesia karena itu adalah tetangga dari Tagalog. Banyak kata dalam bahasa Indonesia yang mirip dengan Tagalog karena mereka dalam keluarga yang sama bahasa. Banyak orang dari Indonesia membantu saya untuk meningkatkan saya bahasa Indonesia. Mereka mengajar saya beberapa bahasa gaul, kata-kata, dan kadang-kadang saya mengajarkan mereka Tagalog terlalu. Ada juga banyak orang di Filipina yang yang sedang belajar bahasa Indonesia juga. Jadi kadang-kadang saya berbicara dengan mereka. What? Okay, so question for people who are multilingual. Does the, because I learned Spanish and French, but I literally didn't take advantage of it in high school. I just was like there to get the grade and get out of there. But like when you learn a language, is it easier to understand it 
after you learn it or is it easier to learn it after you understand it? Like when somebody speaks to you, if you can understand what they're saying, is it easier to learn it after that? Or is it easier to learn it once you've already learned the language? I've always been curious about that. Or maybe it's different for different people, but. Hmm. I don't understand the question. Maybe I'm just not meant for being multilingual. But like, so when, <laughs> when you're speaking another language to me, if I can understand every word you're saying before I even know how to speak the language back to you, would that make would it that easier? How would that be possible? You can still like learn. I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's not possible. I don't know. But I'm just like saying like. Yeah. See, my brain is too small for that question. I, I don't know. Maybe it was a dumb question. You never know. <laughs> maybe know. the question was too super dumb, and now your brain no. can't process it because it's a dumb question. I tried but I to really take am Spanish. curious, and I, I would like to know what you guys think. I tried to take Spanish in high school. They just kicked me out of the classroom. <laughs> like, sir, your tongue, mm, it's not shaped correctly. You, you can could just leave now. Roll your arms. That you was my favorite part now. about Spanish class. My I'm not going to try it. My tongue She will, was very adamant about my that. My tongue gets swollen when I try. I just, <laughs> it gets beat up in my mouth for some reason. <laughs> you can tell I Svenska in Baralita. You take it on Svenska after some that that lot of work at all sexy. You take the that the sprock near you hear the note from Veronica Maza. Sången heter heter Hyte Norr. Svenska är det enda skandinaviska språket som ni vet. Jag hoppas att jag kan lära mig dansk eller norska en dag. Dude, I'm so... Ooh, Russian. I like the way Russian sounds. Min är så smart lång i jag var ju på ruski, men jag har aldrig sagt att jag är så Jag plockar att jag var ju på ruski. Vinit, jag menar. Jag isutchel ruski jazyk, потому что когда не буду я буду любит ездит в Россию и я дома я думаю что Россия прекрасная страна. Dude, he can go everywhere he wants in the world. Yeah, that is awesome. Our friend Adina is from Romania. She is, and she's a twin, which is beautiful. I like that. No, no, me le meu yes Marlon, var bes put sindromun. Um, in what so klimberumuna an trikut? Dar akum no mai var bes klimberumuna. Am itat multe kvinte. Vreo so on what the no klimberumuna. How many is this so far? I don't know. I got lost after like three. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh my Korean. goodness, I'm just mind blown by all this. This kid is incredible. Hello, my name is Marlon. I have a lot of people in Korea. 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 I want to see a video where he like went around to all of these countries and just randomly walks up to somebody and starts switching between languages or something. Yeah. It would be so fun. Their faces would probably be like, <laughs> like, oh, yes. Do no mam you in a Marlon, in a Apotis Philippines, Tora Maceno Elinica, Kikinizeka. I eliniki in mia amor filosa le trevoto elinico alfavito. No way. Wo zao ma long. Wo jin tian wo shi wo shi ba chi shi ba shi. Wo lai zi Filipin. Wo wo shi chongwen he fu jian. Wo you yang ben chong wo shi. Okay, his brain's starting to freeze up. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Dude, that sounds like the hardest language ever. Uh, Are you kidding me? That is insane. I can't. That's insane. I can't. Wait, what did that say? I. It went too is fast. It, it said a uh, Filipino language. Right? A Philippine language? Philippine? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Ang agaw ni kamong amin, magergot talabi ta ibanag. Egalaman ang one hundred thousand nga tolay sa ngaut nga amu magergot ta ibanag. Ibanag? That's right. Yeah, I think so. Ibanag. Kaya usak yao nga lingwahe para ni kamong nga viewers. Amuno yao i nakasta nga lingwahe ta jamie ta tukegrao. So thank you for watching. 
I hope I have said the right words and uh, if I have made mistakes, I'm sorry. I'm not really fluent in all of them. So That's... it's just a practice. So thank you very much. Oh, ah, thank you. Thank you. Are you kidding me? That is I, awesome. I've said this multiple times in our videos because we will have people who will take the time to write in English even though it's not their first language. Mm -hmm. And at the end, they always say, I'm sorry, my English isn't that good. And I'm just like, you should not apologize. No. That is incredible. You yeah. should be so proud of yourself. For real. On our channel, just know, you don't ever have to apologize for anything like that. No. We are like humbled by your incredible talent to be multilingual. Yeah. Like, you should be so proud of that. I, I want to be, I want to have at least bilingual. I at least want to learn one other language besides uh, English, but. I, I just think it's so cool and so amazing that you take the time to, to, to like hone those skills. Yeah. Of all the skills that you can learn in this world. Like I know how to do a few things really well, but to learn a completely different language Oof. and then you learn another one and then another one and then another one and another one another one another one another all one, another one, another one all the way to 18. 18 who cares if you're fluent in all of them My you are goodness. freaking doing a great job yes. that is amazing that is unbelievable that blows my mind because not only that like they have all different kinds of like styles to save them like i oh my gosh my brain would just go i would just be melting i don't know because I, I would try so hard i would think about it first of all the overthinking would just get me and i'd freeze and everything that i was saying but like that was so impressive i can't oh that was I've, awesome i've asked i used to work a lot of construction and i worked with a lot of spanish speaking people and i was just like okay you speak english really well what do you think in what thoughts? What are your thoughts in? Mm -hmm. They're like, what well, depends? Sometimes it's easier to think in English. Sometimes it's easier to speak uh, to to think in in Spanish. It depends on the phrase because I guess some phrases are like just easier to get out in English. Some are easier to get out in Spanish or whatever language you speak. So it's just like once you learn so many and you do become fluent in them, like what language do you think? <laughs> It's just, it's always been a question that I've had in my I mind. I never like, even thought to think like that question. That's an interesting question though, for sure. Because it's like thinking is such a instantaneous mm -hmm. thing. So you yeah. look over there at something and you're like, oh, a red shirt. Yeah. Or, oh, this movie trailer's on. Oh, this thing. And it's just like, I, Some things once are going you're multilingual, you like how does that work? It's just, <laughs> I don't even know. My mind is just boggled by this whole entire thing. Yeah. But, now I'm even more confused. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> that was incredible. That Shout was. out to you, friend. Yeah. This video up on his own channel. We're going to include a link to this original video. Yes, we definitely are. Um, Marlon Marian? Romos. Yeah, Marian Wow. Romos. We are subscribing right now. Yeah, for okay? sure. Like the video. Wow. That was freaking incredible. That is so cool. I, I'm in awe. That's insane. He can understand. It's been two years already. I'm afraid that he even learned some language from another universe. <laughs> <laughs> if he wanted to keep going, yeah, it, the sky's the limit. He, he can is. understand the memes in other languages. He's too powerful. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That is too freaking fun. <laughs> that is I can't so even cool. speak English properly, okay? <laughs> it's too funnily. Are you kidding me? Congratulations. You spoke in my language, which is pork. The pork. <laughs> <laughs> which is portuguese language i am portuguese and you express yourself as a portuguese keep it up so you will have a beautiful future in your life hugs from lisbon portugal Dude, that is so cool such a cool freaking comment section right here because i agree with it this one not only does he speak 18 different languages but he can also mimic accents of the other languages yes that is so amazing that's what i was so impressed with like that's what you said in the thing he can he can speak the different dialect. Is that what the, the, you would call it? Like, cause when you, you speak the language then you speak that certain dialect of how the, how it sounds like. Yeah, we're not even familiar with the wordings of being multilingual. Oh. Okay, so let us know. Yeah, please. He definitely got the accents right. He definitely had the freaking, as a Korean and English native speaker, he did well in speaking Korean. I'm amazed that he got all the grammar right. Good job. That That's is so cool awesome. to know. This is a cool comment section. Wow. Hi, Marlon. You're so talented learning many foreign languages. I love when you speak Swedish. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is so cool. I'm going to have to spend some time in here. Similar to 
to oh i'm not gonna try to attempt that go Watching back up your... go back up to the other one this one says dude this is so amazing like he could just end an argument just by cursing in another dude, language <laughs> you don't even know what to you say have back. infinite power <laughs> oh, that is so freaking cool that was awesome yeah Thank that was super cool to whoever recommended this one shout out to you friend mm -hmm. and uh yeah we want more to see videos. more of this yes, more videos, more videos like, this. like this please that's so fun We'll see you on the next one, friends. Bye, friends. Peace.